I was in the Big Apple as one of the organizers of the Frankie Manning Centennial. Who was Frankie Manning? Well, if you have to ask, you're not a Lindy Hopper. He was the ambassador of Lindy Hop, a New Yorker who, in his youth, helped to develop the dance and, in his age, spread it around the world. Tell them, Leonard. When Frankie was at his peak traveling around, this is maybe late 90s, early 2000s, I once asked him how many weekends per year are you out in New York? And he actually checked his calendar and he came up with 42 weekends. And this is a man being 85, 86, 87, somewhere there. Can you tell that he's Swedish? 2,000 people were coming for the occasion and it took 200 volunteers to run everything. Here we see them preparing registration documents and stuff. Talk me through the process here. Uh, right, so, you. Okay, so that <laughs> opens the ring. And then you stick them in a plastic bag. Okay. After. And then you do it again and again. The calm before the storm. How many computers these days does it take to run an event like this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. To think that the Normandy landings were all done with paper and pen. And now the storm. And shot. Yes. He is just nine. Um, let me pull up your booking. My job was to do the cultural activities. We had museum and art gallery visits. I'm outside the Natural History Museum and we have people here from from Oslo and Vermont and uh, uh, Thessaloniki and, uh, and Vietnam and, I didn't ask you. California. Southern California. Southern California. Okay, so go and get your culture, go in those doors. And, and look at natural history, there's loads of it. Walking tours of architecture and Harlem, a vintage hairstyling workshop, a walk along the High Line, a picnic in Central Park, nice backdrop, a video. I'll be showing what I can salvage of that catalogue of disasters another day. I ended up being detained by the police in Central Park. We also had a gospel brunch, a very New York thing to do, I'm told. Good food, although I'm unused to sweet and savoury mixed like this. Ooh, that's a lot of notes. Two more? One more, do you think? There you go. And I did the flea market challenge, competitive bargain hunting, the international food safari and the photography safari, which is another subject for a video. I also took part in the recreation of a Swedish dance camp with a comic turn and a ska dancing class. The evenings were filled with dancing and shows. I can say now that I've danced at the Alhambra. <laughs> the bar staff were bored. Seen a show at the quite moderate-sized Harlem Apollo, partied till dawn on a Manhattan rooftop, danced to some great bands before staggering home for a few hours of unconsciousness off this grim hotel corridor. Wow, we made a mess. So, I hope this at least partly explains the hiatus in my video <laughs> uploads. Sweet. Lots more to come. And now, if you can stand it, one minute of jazz. <laughs>